Wednesday. Where are we off to this morning, Thomas? Um, Discovery Cove. Yeah. yeah. So this the it is very early. Uh, we've never been to Discovery Cove before, so we're excited to see what that's all about. We haven't got any activities booked, have we? No. Just going to be a relaxing day. Yeah. Swimming with fish, watching the dolphins. <laughs> yeah, we've uh, going to. We decided to be cautious about what we wear because we don't want to get confused with the fishes in the actual pools, do we? With the shape and size that we are at the minute. You're so cheeky. <laughs> I mean, we could get harpooned, Thomas. <laughs> Who knows? That's my joke. Well, I've told it, <laughs> so now it's mine. <laughs> um, we've got food and drink all day, haven't we, there? And stuff, so hopefully we're not going to spend any money on food all day and then this evening we're doing a bit of moonlighting aren't we? Yeah, it's <laughs> to Disney. Yeah we've got um, Animal Kingdom this evening we've got what's yeah. called a moonlight magic event. I don't think that's bearing your bottom <laughs> under the night sky but yeah it's um, it's a DVC event that we've managed to bag tickets for so we'll show you that and there's snacks available there isn't there? Yeah. Free food and drinks again so nice. we really don't want to spend any money on food today. So come with us and we'll take oh, you to yeah. Discovery Cove. And it's quite busy. I bet people have been here quite early though, haven't they? Where's that cute captain? Are you thinking of what jokes you need to crack? I know, entertaining. I know something I'm going to crack. Won't be a joke. Put it that way. You can tell Paul's tired this morning. Why? I'm not tired. No, I think. I need a coffee. <laughs> they really have ramped up the smells in oh, these yeah, buildings. It smells divine in here. It makes me think of Hawaii. <laughs> it's gorgeous. I brought your hula skirt with you. Yeah, I brought me, <laughs> brought me grass skirt with me. Yeah. Oh, it's pretty, isn't it? We've hired a day bed, haven't we? Was it £108 it's come to yeah, for the day? Yeah, $137. Yeah, like a mini cabana. Um, you get like a space in the park. A little bit like... Um, actually, it's a bit different to what we had at Volcano Bay last time, isn't it? Yeah, so we had a clam show at Volcano <laughs> Bay. Oh, we were clammy. <laughs> um, so we'll let you have a little look at that, and then I think we're going to dump our bags and go and get breakfast. So it looks like a lovely park, doesn't it? Mm. There's loads of little like trails and that kind of thing. Really pretty, really pretty. We've got to go to get services and they take us to... Yeah, the we'll show us where we're going to go. Mince. Tropical gifts. We were going to buy another swim top, but I'm not doing it. We've already got two, haven't we? Yeah. One for Volcano Bay and the other one from the Disney Cruise. I'm not going to spend money on another. Oh, I'm feeling tight today, Thomas. <laughs> I think I'll be all right. You'll just have to carry me everywhere. <laughs> I'd have a job. <gasps> Did you hear that, folks? Did you hear what you just said? Oh, yeah. There's no way you're going to squeeze me in one of them wetsuits. <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs> I'll end up looking like Sam Smith <laughs> at the Brit Awards. This is Laguna Grill. Oh, God, I've just nearly dropped, fell down there. <laughs> oh. We'll show you that. There's breakfast in there in a second. So we're going to go and get some breakfast. We'll let you have a little look. Oh, look at all these birds flying around. Oh, folks, there's proper sand. Oh, Thomas, that's going to get everywhere, isn't it? Yeah. Every nook and cranny. <laughs> oh, it's what? Kicking. Oh, look, the dolphins are in there. Oh. There we are. Number five. Yeah, it's like a, it's like a baby cabana, isn't it? Yeah. So, what was that? If you're not doing. So, what are you going to wear on your tour? Well, I might just go bare-chested. Right. Um, 
she's just told us that you're not required, hasn't she, to wear yeah. a... If you're doing the sea diving I've got helmet thing. cinematic mode, because you're very blurred and I'm not. Yeah. It's on cinematic, I think. Oh, hold on, we're, we're cinematic. <laughs> oh, you kept blurring in and out then, Tom. Oops, like you were eyes. fading away. <laughs> um, yeah, if you're, if you're booked like a dolphin swim or a sea diving helmet thing, then they recommend that you wear the wetsuits or the vests or things because the water is only 72, yeah. de 72 degrees, I think, so. which could be quite cool um, if you're in swimming for a long time. But if you're just doing the laser river and the reef, then you're not required to wear it. Okay. So we'll see how warm it is. Lockers are free here as well, just to let you know. Some of these ones here were reserved, but the ones that we just picked up are complimentary. And then you keep that for the whole day because this thing we've rented, this day bed, hasn't actually got a lockable compartment, has it? No, it's two beds and a shelter. Yeah, so that's just a bit of a down thing because it dis not Discovery Cove, but Volcano Bay, that was lockable, wasn't it? Yes. You also can't wear deodorant here, can you? Or, no. And you have to wear their sunscreen because it's animal friendly. Yeah. So you can't lather yourself up in your best uh, Nivea. You have to um, use the stuff provided. Cinnamon World, yeah, Thomas. He's just getting his waffles, so we'll be out in a minute. I think we've got pretty similar stuff though. So I've gone for that, which is sausage, um, potatoes, and scrambled egg. And then I've got, oh, I've got a cup of fruit as well. And then some little um, French toast sticks. And then here he is. Here she is, Gilman already. <laughs> I know, we'll get one afterwards. Oh, see, you've taken full advantage. <laughs> Have you got chicken, waffles, pastries, bagels? I guess you can go back up again, can you? Yeah. Yeah, I might go get some more sausage. Tasty enough. Yeah. Well, that bit's got demolished anyway. Yeah, so this is all included in your, your ticket for the day. And we're going to go and get a little drink in a minute, aren't we? Yeah. Well, but yeah, nice enough. Oh, that sausage is spicy. It is spicy. Oh, it's got a right <coughs> kick to it. But yeah. Decent. We'll have a little chill out on the day bed. Yeah. <coughs> Gather ourselves. Have a little look at the art, the art, uh, the map. Yeah. And then we'll start exploring. Yeah. No, oh, the dolphins are here having, um, there's an experience going on. So you have see them. Oh. You can see them like their heads bobbing out the water. Okay so all along here we think is where you have all of like your experiences with the dolphins and stuff like that. So all around these little coves and things. But these are all paid experiences obviously. Let us know in the comments if you've been here and you've done any of the um, dolphin encounters. I know it's something that not everybody is into, so we appreciate if it's not your thing. I mean, we're not doing this. We're, we're just here to kind of enjoy the water and stuff. But we're not, um, we're not swimming with dolphins, are we? No, we're just <laughs> swimming with a... <laughs> a beluga. <laughs> here, Tom. Why do dolphins not make good students? I don't know. <laughs> because they only ever get to sea level. Oh, God. <laughs> You've been still thinking about that one, haven't you? <laughs> yeah. I knew you'd go in quiet. I knew you were thinking of something. <laughs> and... <laughs> <laughs> Why was the dolphin mean to his other fish friends? <laughs> I don't know. Because <laughs> he insulted them. 
on porpoise. <laughs> Get me another coffee, I'm on a roll. <laughs> Everybody's friendly at Discovery Cove. <laughs> Everyone. <laughs> You're just in the waterproof case, so if the sound goes a bit funny, you know why. We're going to just switch this day bed because this one here isn't comfortable. So talk about a diva. Um, yeah, these plastic wallets, we've got the phone in, they want 28 quid for one here. So like we said when we were at the Volcano Bay, um, on the Volcano Bay, Bla uh, Volcano Bay vlog, these were 8 quid for two off Amazon. So little money saving tip for you. <laughs> it's like he's putting tent on a lard on his face. Is this a lazy river? I think this is a lazy river. Marmosets. Monkeys, is it? Yeah, monkeys. Um, these are like little foot washes, I think. Again, obviously, we're just going to be mindful about filming because there are lots of kids and stuff around. So we'll try and show you some bits, but within reason, I guess. Oh, what's that you're flapping at me, Thomas? Oh, it's a funny colour. <laughs> well, we're not going in there just yet because that's the oasis, yeah. apparently. We want the lazy river. And what is it, Tom? Is it just Budweiser's and wine are included? Yeah, what's in that in front is included all wine. All right, okay. And you can buy a package upgrade so you can go to like premium drinks. Yeah, $40 for the package upgrade. Okay. We're going to the tropical river. Is that right? Well, I don't know. Oh, it's just leading me a merry dance. Oh, is that it? Ah, okay. <laughs> it's warm once you're in, but I bet it's deep. It's just took me by surprise. Oh, here are we. Oh, sit on it. Oh, yeah, you can stand up here. Ah! Where are they, Boston? Where did you put them? I told you. No, he's real. Oh, we need to go and see the otters, Tom, yeah. <laughs> as well. We've just had a mercy mission to rescue my glasses. Because <laughs> when I jumped in the other end, I didn't realise they'd popped off my head. <laughs> so, stepped in. And I did step in. There was a sign saying it was eight and a half feet deep. Oh, I thought it was all right. <laughs> oh, there's a water worm. Oh, it's not a water worm. <laughs> Unless you've done something here, in here you shouldn't have done. <laughs> oh, no, mine wouldn't have looked like a worm, it would have looked like a big snake. Vile, vile. Yes, yeah, so I've salvaged my glasses, thank God. I mean, he did buy them for me, so I'm gonna make sure I get them back. Watching him, watching me, watching him. Oh. You could be anywhere, it's not like being in the middle of uh, a city or Orlando. You could be absolutely anywhere in the world. There's loads of little birds and things that float around, isn't there? Not float, fly around. <laughs> oh, they're the fish that float. Oh, deep. oh is it? Yeah. Whoosh. Yeah, it goes shallow and deep at different points, doesn't it, as well? So you have to be careful. And it's probably strongly advised that you get one of these Noodles. little inflatables. Well, not inflatables, but these... Um... Oh, you're struggling with your words today, though. What is it, Tom? I mean, I've had a traumatic experience. I've lost my glasses. A foam float. A foam float. 
And the other thing is, it doesn't really propel you, this lazy river. You have to kind of help yourself. So it's not as lazy as you might think. You do have to help kind of push yourself around. Oh my God, then we're going up again. Oh God, I can't go. <laughs> it's not like um, Volcano Bay where you're actually like shoved along the water. There it is in the trees. Are they? Oh. 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 Oh my God! They don't do it well. Oh, we just done it behind you. Oh my God! Get me out of here quick! Oh crikey! I know it says muck for luck, but <laughs> I'm not bothered. I buy a lottery ticket. <laughs> um, we're just having a little pit stop, aren't we? Yeah. Have you got a slushy? I have got a slushy. Yes, I've wow. got a mango um slush it is delicious it's a fanta is it mango fanta yeah mango wow. fanta slush are really nice that lazy river is good in it but yeah it doesn't push you along oh that's really reflect reflecting um it's it's like self-propelled isn't it yeah and be warned it well, dips and rises in quite a few different places yeah it's not a yeah it doesn't push you along at all no um but be careful because you'll have to stub your toe and it would be good if you had some um, swimming shoes on yeah. because you do stub your feet. Yeah, because of how uneven the surface is. So if you're a bit wary of things like that, then just to warn you, because it does go kind of very shallow, doesn't it? Yeah. And then really deep. So word of warning. Puff potato one. Potato. That potato, what have you had? Uh, they've got hot cookies. Yeah. They've got crisps. Okay. Barbecue plain. These are all, all free, aren't they? Well, not, they're all included, yeah. Uh, there's pretzels. Just some dipping sauce. Yeah, and then over the far side there is um, like hot food. So, yeah, nice just to keep you tidied over. Oh, is that tidying you over? What happened, Tom? <laughs> it's gone for a, a, a subtle shade of what would you call it? It's mango. <laughs> mango peach. Are you ready? Take your tongue out. <laughs> you look like you've caught something. What's your thing? <laughs> Looks like iodine solution. <laughs> That's what's beautiful about this park is that like all this wildlife is just around <laughs> in every sense. So this is the aviary and you can feed the birds in here. <laughs> A bit like Mary Poppins. <laughs> she was always uh, generous with her tuppence. What they're getting Tom for lunch mixture of different things as oh okay look at these they're all around aren't they so I guess you can't feed them a cause, unfortunately. I mean, they might take your bloody hand off. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh! Wow! I made a friend, Tom. We've just seen the otters, haven't we? Yeah. Oh, you like a little otter, don't you? You were back amongst your kind, weren't you? I was, yeah. Cute and furry, that's me. <laughs> oh, please. It is lunchtime, so these are just a few of the offerings for lunch. Pineapple with rum sauce, coconut crusted salmon, island rice, 
and then all of this yumminess as well. And it's kind of the same both sides on here. And then they've got wraps. There you go, they have salad wraps, vegetable wraps, quinoa. There is some little salad toppings here as well. So it's the same both sides here, I think. And then you can get Laguna burgers and chicken tenders. And they are from this bit here. I think they're all being made fresh. So yeah, plenty of choice. What have you got? It's salmon. Yeah. A little slice of chicken. Yeah. Some vegetables. A burger with no bun. Oh, a naked, and and naked burger. They call that a naked burger. I've been a bit simple. <laughs> and the same goes for my choices as well. Um, I've just had a burger and just some mac and cheese. There's loads of choice, isn't there? Though? There's plenty of stuff if you want it. Plenty of different things. We're going to have a little explore across the other side now, aren't we, Tom? Yeah. Oh, it is warm, folks. Christ, it's hot underneath them. That canvas, isn't it? Oh, yeah. That... <laughs> Oh, we are absolutely boiling. It's like being in a little bakehouse. It's yeah. really warm. Very hot. So we're going to have a little look at this side and show you what's going on. <laughs> Meet an armadillo, Tom. <laughs> you could have met an armadillo at half past ten. Oh, the sloths as well. Yeah. Don't adjust your set, folks. It's <laughs> not Casper the Friendly Ghost. <laughs> I mean, you might as well have gone one further and bought a tin of emulsion with you. <laughs> Probably would have been just as effective. It's so thick. It is thick. Well, appropriate then, isn't it? There's a lot of stingers coming Oh my God, the stingrays in here, apparently. <laughs> Go on. Oh my God, Tom, it's cold. <laughs> oh, it's fresh, kids. It's fresh. Are they just swimming around? Oh, there's that one there, my God. It's like it's Mr. Got Nemo. Patterns all over it, though. It's the Mr. Nemo one. Yeah. Uh, Finding Nemo one. <laughs> Look at you getting excited. <laughs> um, we should give a little shout out to Rob and Darren at this point, shouldn't we? If you're watching, gents, we think about you when we stood here because we saw you do this on one of your previous trips. So, a little hello from us. Yeah, you're braver than us. I don't yeah. think I'd like to do the helmet yeah. thing. This side of the park is quieter where the reef is. There's nothing else kind of past this. So that's pretty much everything, isn't it, I would say. So there's lots and lots of things to do here. You can chill out, you can get involved in activities and things. This is um, just a nice little walkway back to the other side of the, the reef now. But we've just had, we've just been paddling with the stingrays, haven't we? It's been really good, really good just something a bit different that we've always seen but never done so that's another little box that we can tick now very it's good nice and cool over this side yeah i've not got any anything on my feet so <laughs> i'm skipping like bambi over these hot floors so discovery cove thoughts yep nice, nice park yeah it's not somewhere to come to if you want rides because there's no rides here for me it's a one and done yeah it's it's pleasant enough it's nice and relaxing it's a lot more chilled out than the other water parks in the area we probably wouldn't come back in any rush 
but we quite enjoy the the faster lazy river and we enjoy a few of the flumes and things don't we so you've enjoyed yourself there yeah you've had a little moment talking to the animals yeah it, it's it's been a nice day it has dr doolittle it has been a nice day but i wouldn't <laughs> i was trying to get a joke in then well i was i was just <laughs> dr do, that. dr do very little <laughs> Well, that's what we've been today. Yeah. Carry on. What are you going to say? Yeah, I've done it now. Oh. I don't think it's... Yeah. I don't think it's somewhere that I'd pay all that money to rush no. back to. But snacks and everything, your food and everything is all yeah. included. It's great value in that respect. Especially if you're with a, a big party as well. Because you can just keep going back for as much as you want all day. All day. There's, um, as I say, alcoholic drinks, there's snacks, so much stuff. And um, it's a lovely park as well, really, really kind of um, open and picturesque and full of nice little bits. So it's it's I one. Buy a D bed again. No, we would probably wouldn't do that. The, the beds were a bit uncomfortable, actually. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah, the beds were weren't that comfortable. We paid one hundred and eight pounds for a little tent with two beds, and yeah. the beds that were free beside the beach maybe didn't have a cushion on but they were actually comfier yeah. than the ones we were going but um as well it was very warm underneath there weren't yeah. it they were like little tents um so they were very stifling inside because there was no fans or yeah. anything so but part of the reason why we chose that as well is because if we were going to do filming and talking and stuff it's a bit more private and it's less intrusive on other people so but at least we've tried it and yeah yeah. We know that next time we probably wouldn't bother that yeah. with that. So that's done. So what we're going to do now is we're going to head back and we're going to go and have a quick freshen up. And after that, when you see us, we should be arriving or just in the Animal Kingdom Park because we've got our Moonlight Magic this evening. So we're going to take you along to that, show you that, something again we've never done before. So it's a full, full day of newness today, even though, of course, we've done Animal Kingdom Park. So come with us. He's directing me again, even though he doesn't know where we park. Oh, so. I know exactly where we're parked. Do you? Oh, well. Right, so we'll see you at Animal Kingdom. Right. Well, we're just on the car park for Animal Kingdom, aren't we? We're ready to go into the moonlight magic. It's 6.02pm. Uh, mm. There's just one little thing that's stopping us from doing anything at the moment. You may be able to hear it. Can you hear? <laughs> you might see through the window. <laughs> it is absolutely bucketing it down. That's what we can do it for. Yeah. Just have to wait it out. It looks like it's going to clear though. How long have we been sitting here? About 40 minutes. Yeah, I think people are even going home. <laughs> and they've just arrived. Yeah. We'll see. We'll see how we go. We'll wait it out. This event doesn't actually start until 8 o'clock, so we've got a, a bit yet. Oh, it's wet, people, it's wet. But are we him? Oh, getting soaked to Animal Kingdom. Oh, that was a bit of rain then, wasn't it? It's easing off now, it's getting lighter. I'm trying. Have a magical evening. Oh, let's hope this rain stops. Oh, right, we ventured into the moonlight magic. <laughs> Even though it's very damp, the rain is kind of still with us. You've got coupons, haven't you, Thomas? Yes, coupons. The certificate may be redeemed at any of the participating locations. Ice cream, 5 to 10.30. 5 to 11. Oh, All right, OK. Do you want to go under somewhere yeah. for a bit so we can put this in the bag? Oh, folks, are we mad? Of course we are. So these are what they give you when you check in and they're like snack vouchers and you can redeem them at these different places. Complimentary ice cream. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I think it adds to the ambiance, don't you? <laughs> Poor Tom's feet are so kid as well. See, the skies are clearing here. Yeah. It's getting better. So you get a little wristband as well <laughs> just like a normal after hours event in it but Free. but yeah complimentary because of our dvc <laughs> yeah. 
You know, we were always DVC, Thomas. <laughs> Definitely very camp. <laughs> there are some rare characters as well, I think, that come out, aren't there? There's a thing, characters from Tarzan. <laughs> I don't mean Tom, <laughs> beating his chest. Um, <laughs> you'll be something. Um, there's Manny from um, A Bug's Life. Oh, yes. Yeah, well, so if we see any of the characters around, then obviously we'll see you. You know we're not big for meet and greet. We're on the hunt for a bit of merch because apparently there's a bit of Moonlight Magic merch available in Chester and Heston's down here. So that's what we're looking for. Oh, I love this song. <laughs> um, the event doesn't start officially for another um, 17 minutes. So, and I think because of the rain, the park has cleared a lot. So I reckon it'll be fairly quiet this evening, don't you? Yeah because usually when these events happen, there's like the crossover between everyone in the day and folk that are just arriving for the event. So I think it's going to be fairly quiet tonight. Oh, well, that's an epic fail, isn't it? Because the lady's just told us that it's only available on Shop Disney. I think there's about, I think there's two t-shirts and a hoodie though. So we just wanted something to commemorate the evening, but that's, that's put that to bed. Oh, don't you think you're colorful enough, Tom? Your language certainly is. It's very nice. Is it a jumper or a spirit it's jersey? A spirit jersey? It's very psychedelic. <laughs> Isn't it? Yeah. Oh, look at this. Vault collection stuff. Oh, that's camp. Look at that. Oh, I like that. Look at that. Yeah. That's nice as well. Oh, the electrical parade. Yeah. Oh, that's really nice. Oh. Oh, I like that as well. <laughs> oh, they've only got small in that though, which is a shame. It's lovely there. Oh, you can spend and spend, can't you? I liked this little grey t-shirt here as well. Well, it's a little jersey. That's nice, isn't it? I'm having to start buying larges and things because when they've been washed, they really do start to like ride up your arms. We're gonna go do dinosaur. Uh, it's posting just a 10 minute wait. So that's a good start to the evening. And then once we come out of here, everything will kind of, I think, have officially kicked off. So we'll maybe go and grab a snack or we'll maybe go and do another ride. And hopefully, now the skies are clearing, Everest will be, active which is good Ten minutes, let's walk on. We still haven't seen dinosaur have we yeah. <laughs> well not the film anyway yeah. <laughs> have we hello there welcome to our little trans-dimensional joyride folks i'm dr seeker your friendly controller and a heck of a paleontologist if i do say so myself We won't do any on-ride footage because it's very dark in there, isn't it? Yeah, and very bumpy. Yeah, and you've got to hold on with two hands. <laughs> and the vehicle as well. So we'll probably see you when we come off this. We're not going to make it. <laughs> I'm jiggled all over <laughs> with that. Jiggle, jiggle. Jiggle, jiggle. Bye-bye. <laughs> Hi, thank you. Oh, there we go, Thomas. It was worth being patient for, wasn't it? What you waiting for? Cheese fries and chili. Yeah, chili cheese, chili cheese fries. We're waiting for. Um, they're not on there though. I don't think it's part of an event menu, isn't it? Oh, oh, okay. So it's cheese fries and chili. Three thirty-two. Is that us? Oh my god, that's. Thank you. That's quite a lot, actually. No, it's fine, thanks. Oh my God, it smells really nice. Oh, am I going first? Oh. oh, so this is the chili cheese fries that we've got as part of our coupons, not vouchers, Thomas. Coupons, remember? Mmm, 
nice. Mm. Yeah, tasty. Mm. Um, apparently, today is National Ice Cream Sandwich Day. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, we've got a free. Oh, that's the wrong way around. There we go. We've got free ice creams, freebies. These are delicious. And you can keep having as many of these as you want, can't you? I mean, not that you'd want too many, but it's, again, a little perk. So, we're going to maybe have a couple while we're here. Just a couple. What's calling us? Hmm? What's calling us? The mountain. The call of the Yeti. Look at the colour of it. Oh, these bells. Good God. <laughs> There's always one, isn't there? There's always one. Um, yeah, Expedition Everest has opened. So, <laughs> oh my goodness me. But picked this camera up at the wrong time, didn't we? Um, so yeah, I don't know how long this wait is, but hopefully it won't be too long. Oh, they've had a leak in here, Tom. <laughs> yeah, well, I was like that, waiting in that car earlier on. Oh, I've never seen rain like it, kids. Oh, my God, it is. Mm. Yeah, this is bad. I mean, that was a hell of a lot of rain. See? Camping's dangerous. I should know. <laughs> Here comes our ride. We're off to see the Yeti. <laughs> Is it called Betty? <laughs> yeah. Betty, Betty the, Yeti. the Yeti. Oh, well, I'm not filming any more of this because you can't see anything. <laughs> Oh, we love a bit of Everest, don't we? Yeah, it was really good. Um, apparently, we've, we've just looked at stuff in the yeah. shop, haven't we? Yeah. And she told us oh, we can't buy blurred. anything. I was blurred, or is it foggy? It's foggy, I think, because of the humidity. Oh, yes. Um, yes, yeah, so we can't buy anything, can no, we? No, no match. Oh, well, I'm sure my bank manager will be very pleased about that. <laughs> we'll have to come back. We will. What's going on in there? Oh, we'll oh is it characters? Oh. Who is it? Yeah. Shh. Leave Africa and enter Pandora. Crikey. Thought David Bellamy had passed away. David Bellamy is meant to be David Attenborough. Oh, David Attenborough. Well, I mean. The resemblance was uncanny and unnatural, wasn't it, folks? <laughs> oh, I'll tell you it's unnatural. Oh, oh, I think it's so clever. Isn't it? Oh, I'm lost. We're going to do flight of passage. 15 minutes. Oh, Mr. P, this is a first for us, isn't it? Yeah. This is kind of like rope drop. Oh, we've never been up the stairs on this, Thomas. No, we haven't. Is this the penthouse? Yes. <laughs> the Pandora penthouse. Welcome to the Avatar program. Soon, you're going to have a chance to undertake an amazing Navi Rite of Passage, flying on the back of this powerful animal called an Ikron, or as we call it, a Banshee. Uh, you've all got them. Oh, we just done Flight of Passage, haven't we? Yep. 
15 minutes straight on. Very good. I don't know whether it's rain coming off the buildings or... I can't hear you. Come here now. Oh, we've just got more ice cream, haven't we? Yeah. Oh, God, I'm feeling sick. Uh, we're going to do the River Rapids now, like fools. <laughs> you don't normally get weight on this, so... Yeah, but that'll be famous last words now. You watch the hopefully. It's like when we were saying, oh, it won't rain for very long, and then we've been... Already more. We've been sat in the... We were sat in the car for about an hour and 35 minutes. Spooky, don't you? <laughs> you think it's what? Spooky. Oh, the moon is out. I never quite understand what this theme is about, do you? Oh, it's about people All right, okay. Oh, here we go. Oh, oh. Lucky. <laughs> We're having dumplings, aren't we? <laughs> Chicken dumplings. Then we've used all our credits now, haven't we? Yeah. Our little snack credit things that they've given us. Are they warm? Oh god, they're fresh out of the oven. Are you trying your sauce? I was gonna look it up. Oh, I'm getting into it. Mmm. Sauce is nice. You're not in the sauce. Right. And we're just going to go and have one more ride on Everest, aren't we? Yep. And then we're going to call it a night. So when we see you next, it will be just to sign this off and say good night. Oh my god, that's amazing. Oh, Tom, we don't need a Christmas tree. We'll just get one of them. <laughs> and it can go wherever we want. We're just back from the Moonlight Magic event, aren't we? Yeah. What did you think? Yeah, it was good. Hardly any queues, good snacks, good... Yeah, it was good. Yeah. Um, Definitely worth it. We did Everest again, didn't we? Twice, yeah, it was good. We've had a really good day today. Um, we enjoyed Discovery Cove, but we probably wouldn't rush back. Um... We kind of think we've done it. And again, if it's the kind of thing you want that's a bit more relaxing and it's got no rides and stuff, it's great. Now, tomorrow we are booked into Epcot, but we don't know whether we're going to do that, do we? Um, we'll see. We'll see what time we get up because um, we perhaps might have a little lie-in tomorrow and then maybe just do a few, a, few, a few chilly out things. But we'll let you know in due course. So thank you for being with us today. It's been a day of two halves with Discovery Cove and Moonlight Magic. It really was Moonlight Magic, wasn't it? Because the moon did come out at the end after all that rain. So thank you for being with us. And uh, if you enjoyed today, obviously do the usual. Give it a like, give it a subscribe and leave us a comment. We really appreciate it if uh, you let us know your thoughts, but be kind, of course, please be kind. And we will see you on the next one. And we'll let you know what we do when we do it. At night. Say that night, Thomas. At night, do <laughs>